Here's the thing, though. The more prosperous uh, President Zuma becomes, the more obvious his failures are, and the more the ANC plays the race card to deflect legitimate criticism. Racism is evil, and we must condemn it. But it cannot be that if you are white and you don't agree with the ANC, you are called a racist. And if you are black, you are called a sellout. These are hateful insults in the context of our history. They are designed to diminish the ANC's opponents. What the ANC doesn't get is that every time it plays the race card and labels its opponents as sellouts, it diminishes in its own stature. How can it be, honorable members, that an organization that produced the likes of Oliver Tambo, Walter Sisulu, Nelson Mandela, has been reduced to President Zuma? How can that be? In fact, the ANC likes to call us sellouts because they don't see that slowly but surely the people of South Africa are beginning to realize who the real sellouts are. Because in fact, a sellout is a person who puts his interests before the struggle of his people. A person who secures an advantage for himself in other people's suffering. To deny your citizens freedom so that you can carry on living an unimaginable luxury is surely the greatest treasure. To unstitch our democratic constitution thread by thread so that you and your friends can loot is surely will be the ultimate betrayal. You see, Deputy Speaker, the biggest sellout in our country is none other than President Zuma.